Welcome in, I'm Kimberly. This is Pretty Over 50, where we talk everything beauty, fitness, and lifestyle for the over 50 woman. Oh my gosh, I'm so looking forward to this video today. We're gonna have so much fun. First of all, we're gonna do a little spring fashion show from one of my favorite clothing companies, Lily Silk. And that portion of the video is sponsored by Lily Silk. And then <laughs> I'm gonna share with you several things that I'm loving. And they're all different types of products. And how I came to decide to talk about those things is I thought, these are really good, they're not all related, but they're products that I've tried. I think they're really worth the money. They're really unique. I'm really loving them. They're a big part of my life. I thought you might wanna hear about them too. If you're new here, I'm so glad you stopped by. I hope you'll consider subscribing while you're here and make sure you click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you want all the good stuff, you might wanna sign up for my Sunday morning email newsletter. The link is in the description box down below. It comes out every Sunday morning. No surprise there. It is probably the most popular thing about my channel and we're a big group of women now. Every Sunday morning, I send out a very short, very sweet, but very informative email newsletter sharing with you all the cool things I found throughout the week, whether it's a great sale or something that I'm really loving, a good piece of information or something funny that I just wanted to share. It's super easy to sign up. You just click the link in the description box down below. It comes straight to your email inbox on Sunday morning. There's a whole group of us that grab our coffee, <laughs> read the Sunday morning email newsletter, and then watch the Sunday video. It's a lot of fun. I think you're going to love it. I am so excited today to do a little spring fashion show from one of my very favorite clothing companies, Lily Silk. I wear Lily Silk all the time and you guys see me in it all the time. They're really my classics, my beautiful pieces, my year after year after year. They just last season after season and they're just absolutely gorgeous. This collection that I'm going to be sharing today, I am absolutely in love with. Classic, beautiful, incredible incredibly well made, just really staple pieces that you'll own for years to come. I love my Lily Silk pieces. They're just so beautiful. You can pair them with a pair of jeans or a skirt or a shirt. You can pair your Lily Silk with casual clothes or more dressy clothes. They always look fabulous. This particular collection I'm showing today, I have such a heart for every piece I'm in love with. We're gonna start off first with this beautiful little sweater that I'm wearing. This is absolutely so beautifully made and one of those pieces that you can pair with so many different things. It is just the right cream color and fits beautifully. I will have all the links for everything I'm showing today in the description box as well as the sizes that I'm wearing. This particular top I'm absolutely loving. You can see it goes with so very many things. The next piece I want to share is this jacket. I'm so in love with this jacket. First of all, navy is just a classic color and the cut and fit on this jacket is just beautiful. You have the decorative buttons down the front, really trim in the waist and kind of a flare out, which is such a flattering look. Beautiful coloring on this jacket and these pieces are made so well. This is fully lined, just exquisite design and craftsmanship on these pieces of clothing. This jacket I will have in 20 years. <laughs> It is that well made and that beautiful and it goes so beautifully with the ivory sweater. The next piece up is this skirt. How much do you love this skirt? Oh my gosh. To me, it is so classic, so slimming, so beautiful. It is a knit skirt with the navy striping in a vertical pattern, which is so slimming. I think it's beautiful. You can see it looks gorgeous with this cream colored shirt and looks so sophisticated with that jacket. I'm loving the length in this because it's a little bit more forgiving for legs when you're a little bit older my legs are not that great but this gives a nice length for a nice slender slimming look and oh my gosh with the jacket is that the most beautiful out to lunch outfit or even an evening dinner this skirt is just so comfortable it has a stretch waist at the top very very comfortable very very oh stretchy and just feels really good on so loving this beautiful skirt 
And the last piece I want to talk about today are these slacks. Again, I just can't stress how beautifully well made these pieces are. So quality, you're going to have them in your wardrobe just year after year. These slacks are so comfortable and so well cut. They have a nice trouser look in the front. In the back, there's a little bit of stretch, so super comfortable. And then of course, the wonderful pockets. And these are just so lovely. The beautiful cut and then down at the bottom there's a nice cuff giving them just such a tailored look and with the cream sweater and the jacket I think it's just such a classic gorgeous well tailored look. So these slacks are new favorites for me. You'll be seeing me wearing these quite a bit. Let's go ahead and take a look at part of the new spring collection from Lily Silk. Everything is going to be listed in the description box down below. This is just part of their gorgeous spring collection. There's a lot more styles for you to see over on the website. My pieces from Lily Silk are my favorites. They're classics, they last forever, and they're so well made. Thank you again, Lily Silk, for sponsoring this portion of the video. I am loving this new spring collection. Now I want to share with you some products that I've stumbled upon and I'm absolutely loving and none of them have anything to do with each other. <laughs> They're just individual things that I thought, oh my gosh, I want to share. So that's what we're doing today. The first product I want to share is this retinol from Avin. Have you seen this? How I came across this is I saw a few influencers talk about how much they love this and I heard it and heard it and heard it and I finally thought, okay, I'll give it a try. When I looked on the website, I was like, oh my gosh, that's expensive. This little container right here, and let me see, it is 30 mLs. This is almost $90. And I looked at that and I thought, I don't know. Then I went ahead and bit the bullet and bought it. And I thought, oh my gosh, if this is $90 and it's only going to last for a month, I'm not going to be really very happy about it. So when it came in, I put the date on it when I started using it because I wanted to see how long is this going to last if it only lasts a month I don't know if that's such a good value regardless of how good it is. So I started using this on 12-10 of last year of 2023. So December 10th of last year that's when I started using this and you know what it still hasn't ran out. <laughs> That's really a good thing. Now, about two to three weeks after I started using this, I was so impressed. I am not kidding you. I absolutely love this formula. There is something about it. Not only does it have retinaldehyde, which is one of the strongest forms of the retinoids that you can get in an over-the-counter product. Now, why is it stronger? That's kind of a misnomer in the sense that the reason that retinaldehyde is a little bit more expensive usually is because it's been processed so that your skin only has to go through one step to convert it for use on your skin. Now, tretinoin, which which is prescription, or at least behind the paywall in the US, it's actually over the counter in a lot of other countries. Tretinoin doesn't have to go through any steps. In other words, your skin doesn't have to convert it in order to use it. With retinaldehyde, which is in here, one step conversion, which is quicker than any other retinoid products out on the market. Now, I was a little bit skeptical when I paid $90 for this and I thought, oh my gosh. So I started using it. Let me tell you what, my skin looked so good after about two to three weeks of using this and I wasn't even using it every single night. I was using it about oh three to four nights a week. There was something about the smoothness of my skin, the texture of my complexion. I absolutely really really like this product so much to the point that I almost did a video saying you guys have got to try this but then I thought well maybe I'm just getting over my skis a little bit. What I can say 
is it's really, really good. And there's still product in here. Now I use this about three to four nights a week on my face and on my neck and down onto my chest a little bit, not over my whole chest because this is spindy. There is still product in here, but I don't know how much because there's no way to tell in these types of bottles. But I do a good two pumps for my neck and upper chest area, a good two, two and a half pumps for my face, and there's still product in here. So if you've been looking at this, but the price stopped you, what I can say is I think it's worth it. It really is a good formula. However, stay tuned because I'm gonna talk about something in a second that you might wanna try first. Anywho, this Aven Retinal, which is a retinal to hide cream, really, really love this. It did wonderful things to my skin above and beyond the retinaldehyde that's in the formula, which of course is what helps your skin turn over and act a little bit younger. But let me show you something else that you might wanna try first before you pick this up. The Ordinary just launched a new product. This is Retinol 0.2 Emulsion. Now this is also a retinaldehyde product. I have only used this once and I only used it to see what the formula looked like, to see how the packaging works, whether it came out nicely, whether it felt good. I was just kind of giving it a first glance. This is a brand new product. I am not going to start using this yet because I'm still finishing up my event, but when I'm done with my event, I'm gonna move on to this. This is also a retinaldehyde product like the event, and it's from The Ordinary, and I really trust The Ordinary to put together a very good product at a very good price. Here's what's interesting about this. Now let me see what this is 15 mls. This is $14.90. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. The Aven is 30 mLs, it's $90. The Retinol 0.2 Emulsion from The Ordinary is 15 mLs, so half the amount for $14.90. Now, here's the curious thing. I don't know if this is going to do to my skin what this appeared to do. There was something about this formula that just made my skin look so smooth and yummy and healthy. I really, really was impressed. I don't know if this formulation from The Ordinary is gonna do the same thing. When I'm done with this, I'll give this a whirl and I'll give you an update. However, if you're thinking about getting this product, I don't know, you might wanna pick this product up first just to see what it does for your skin. If you're not thrilled, then you definitely can go ahead and try this. Or you can just jump into this if that $90 price tag doesn't scare you. Now, the interesting thing about this is $90 is a lot to me. That's expensive skincare in my world. For some people, that's just fine. Everybody has their own price point that feels comfortable to them. However, the fact that I am still using this and it is nearly the end of March in 2024, so three months, the fact that I'm still using this is impressive to me. So that means the price per use is not quite as high as it would seem with the price tag. That's probably more than you needed to know about retinol to hide. These are both available now. You might wanna give one of them a try. The next product I wanna talk about is a makeup product that I've actually fallen in love with. Here's how this came to be. This is the IT Superhero No Tug Shadow Stick. The reason I picked this up is that there's a shadow in the ColourPop palette that I've been using that I absolutely love, but the palette's huge and I was traveling a lot and I didn't wanna to have to take that whole palette with me. So I started looking around for some kind of taupey, cool colored, just subtle shadow that I could wear that would be easier than carting that whole ColourPop palette. <laughs> around with me. And I picked this one up from It Cosmetics. This color is Transformational Taupe, and I'm really, really liking it. It's a very, very subtle color. You can see it on the back of my hand right there. And I'm actually wearing it on my lids today, just a one and done shadow color. And all I'll do is I'll just kind of draw this on my eyelid and then tap it out with my finger. And I'll go up to this transition area and then just tap it out and it taps out beautifully. I love this color and I love the formula. It does not 
crease. Honestly, it doesn't. I haven't had it crease at all. And I have used it with shadow primer, particularly the Milani eyeshadow primer, and I've used it with nothing. And it behaves great both ways. So I don't think you need to use an eyeshadow primer with this. This is a great formula in that it blends in really beautifully. And I really love this color because it's just subtle. It's subtle and pretty. It covers up the little discolorations on my lids. It blends in beautifully. It does increase. It's really all good. I don't really remember how much this was. It'll be linked in the description box down below. However much it was, it's worth it. <laughs> That's my opinion. So loving this transformational taupe from the IT Cosmetics Superhero No Tug Shadow Stick line. There's lots of other colors too. Now I want to talk about multi-formula serums for a particular reason. I have traveled more than usual in the last several months and one of the things that I do when I travel is I only bring a carry-on. I only bring a carry-on and then I have my backpack. I don't like to check luggage. I just don't want my luggage to end up in Des Moines and I'm in California. <laughs> or something. In addition, it's just easier. So I'm very, very conservative when I travel and I'm always trying to come up with little tips and tricks to pack less, to pack more conservatively, to have fewer things that I have to carry in that carry-on. One of the things that I've started doing with my skincare when I travel is I take a multi-use serum instead of a whole bunch of serums. So what do I mean by multi-use? I'm talking about serums that have a lot of different ingredients in them. The first one I have here, and I used this the last trip that I took, this is the Needleless Serum from Dermatology. If you haven't tried this, this is awesome. It is kind of a multi-purpose, lots of ingredients, great for your skin serum. So this is what I took my last trip. Now the trip before that, I took the Buffet by The Ordinary. And the Buffet, again, has lots of different ingredients, and it has two formulations now. The the original buffet and then they just changed the name remember it used to be the buffet with copper peptides from the ordinary now they're calling it the multi-peptide copper peptide serum so this is what I took last time just one of these bottles I think I took the original buffet what I do is this is all I use morning and evening when I'm traveling so I have my face wash and I have my moisturizer and I have my Invisicrate body balm in a little baggie for my neck because that's important to me. And then I just use the one serum morning and night and everything works really nicely. It's nice to only have to pack one serum. It really cuts down on the things I'm putting in my suitcase and it works perfectly. I go back to my regular routine when I get home using a number of different serums both morning and evening. But for a trip of a week or less, this works wonderfully and it'll save you a lot of space in your suitcase. Now we're gonna talk about a couple of food-related items in this first one. It's gonna crack you guys up. It's potato chips. <laughs> I know me talking about potato chips, but I have a good reason and I'll tell you why. I am really focusing on protein in my diet because I'm working on getting fitter, building more lean muscle, losing fat. I've come a long way, but I've still got a ways to go. However, from time to time, I like a little yummy with my steak in the afternoon or a little something with a bowl of soup. And I have found these chips that are cooked in olive oil. Now the biggest issue for me with regular chips, and I don't eat regular chips, is they're cooked in seed oils. And in my mind, seed oils are one of the most evil food items. <laughs> out in the market. I really contribute seed oils with a lot of the obesity that we're seeing right now, particularly in the U.S. Seed oils cause inflammation. And a lot of the people walking around thinking they're fat really are more inflamed than anything. Seed oils were not a food. They were actually lubrication for mechanical equipment. Somebody came up with the bright idea that they could process it down and serve it as food, and they had a huge marketing plan, heart healthy or some other baloney. <laughs> 
and sold the whole public on it when in fact they're highly inflammatory and really a toxic food. So I found these potato chips. They're from a company called Boulder Canyon and I actually get these at Publix. Not every Publix has them and I found they sell out pretty darn quickly because people are catching on about the whole seed oil thing. So these are really good. Now they're not made with organic potatoes. That would even kick it up a notch for me. They're just regular potatoes but the fact that they're cooked in avocado oil really works for me. This particular flavor is my favorite. It's the malt vinegar and sea salt and they're kettle style so they're really crispy. If you're looking for that little crunch and that kind of salty flavor, these hit the mark for me. And they have the regular sea salt. I prefer the malt vinegar because it's just that little tangy kind of taste sensation. Now I don't eat a lot of carbs. I do eat some carbs. So for 14 chips there are 16 grams of total carbs. So I will have these often, well, maybe a couple times a week at lunchtime with my steak. I'll grab a handful of these chips around 14 or 16 and I know I'm getting some carbs but just not a lot of carbs. Plus it adds that nice crunchy, salty, yummy, tasty things. Anywho, if you want healthier chips, I'm saying it would be healthier if they were organic potatoes, but they're regular potatoes. But if you want a healthier choice than a chip that's cooked in seed oils, you might want to give these a try. They're actually pretty yummy. The last thing I want to talk to you guys about today is digestive enzymes. And the reason I'm bringing this up is Connie and I had a conversation a couple weeks ago now about healthy eating and how do we get our bodies detoxed and cleaned out? How do we live healthier in a toxic world? And digestive enzymes came up. I really became even more aware of the power of digestive enzymes when I was talking to a functional physician in my area. And she said that her her vitamin D numbers went way up in her blood work when she started taking digestive enzymes. And boy, my little ears perked up because when we have good vitamin D absorption in our body, our immune system just almost becomes invulnerable. It is such an important part of a good immune system. And the only difference that she did with her supplementation is she added digestive enzymes and she said her vitamin D numbers went way up. That's good information for me. A lot of people during the conversation with Connie and I asked about digestive enzymes. Which one do you use? This is the one I've been using lately. It's from a company called Zenwise and it's digestive enzymes and I just take one before every meal. There might be much better companies than this one. I am happy with this one. It has a lot of good reviews on Amazon but then again we always have to be a little careful with the reviews on Amazon because they're so manipulated. However, I'm using these and liking these. There's also digestive enzymes from BodyWise. They're the company that I take their amino acids, the perfect aminos every morning. They have digestive enzymes as well. A little bit more expensive. I've used those in the past and really love them. I'll try to have a discount code linked down below for you if you want to try those out. But I'll have these linked down below if you want to give them a try. Again, I just take one before every meal. Digestive enzymes, uh, you know what? I don't think you can go wrong. Well, that's what I have for you today. This was a lot of fun for me. These products that I shared with you, I'm telling you what, I really do love them. I think you might enjoy them as well. I hope you found this video fun, useful, and helpful. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. You guys know it just tickles me when you take a few minutes out of your day to spend it with me. I appreciate that and I appreciate you. Again, I'm Kimberly. This is Pretty Over 50 where we talk everything beauty, fitness, and lifestyle for the over 50 woman. Make it a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.